Hey everybody, it's T-Mac, it's Teachable Time, and this video and all the Teachables brought to you by the great folks at OutWest Officials. Visit them on the World Wide Web at outwestofficials.com and use the promo code CCS10 for 10% off your next order. So it's minor league teachable this time, and it's Pensacola at Chattanooga. We're in a three-person crew in the top of the eighth inning, first and third. Just wanted to point out that this is a time-play situation. Everybody loves to point their finger to their wrist with a runner on second base and two outs, but runners on first and third and one out. Another excellent chance for a time play, Same, similar to second and third, one out. Any of these situations, you always have to be alert for something weird happening, and that's what we have on this play. A fly ball to shallow outfield, center field, so we've got a potential tag up. Our home plate umpire, Will Moreno, gets in position to see the tag up and then gets back in position to see the possible out safe at the plate with all the other machinations going on, and James Jean has a out call at second base involving R1, so that should be the third out of the inning. The fielders are not leaving. James Jean actually points to third base. I don't know if saying like the ball is in play, and we get an out call on the appeal. There's really no way to definitively see this on replay, and that's not why we're showing you this. It's showing you an apparent fourth out. Oh, my goodness. First and third, one out. Yeah, catch. That's out two. Play it at second. That's out three. And all of a sudden, we get a play at third base. That is an out, and that appeals the run that scored. And so no run is going to score on this play. So after you have this scenario as the home plate umpire, you always want to alert the press box with your hands over your head or the official score if you don't have a press box. If you're in an amateur game, maybe possibly both coaches as well if the run doesn't score, just so everybody's clear in the scorebooks. But this is a very well-officiated play. Love the whacker mechanic on this. When you have an appeal play, you don't want to give it a soft sell out call. You want to give it some kind of mechanic like both these mechanics from Moreno and Gene on this play and not seen Macon Hammond was our first base umpire so again you have your third out at second base you can kind of see quickly that the fielders they're jogging off the field and then they stop it was almost like red light green light red light everybody stop go to third base get the out so this is a legal fourth out appeal of R3 leaving early at third. Very well done by the officiating crew, well handled, and the third base coach doesn't put up much of an argument on this play. Visit us on the World Wide Web at CloseCallSports.com. Visit us on the socials, Discord, Facebook, and Twitter at Close Call Sports. And always do what's right, not what's easy. Happy umpiring. Everyone. <laughs>